Hey, what is up and welcome to Insurance Agent Training live every Monday, two o'clock Central Standard Time. Today, I am in my hotel room in Phoenix, Arizona. Just finished the retreat, just coming off the retreat, had an amazing time. And today I wanna to talk a few minutes about promotion, branding, and advertising. And that's something that we went through a lot of on this retreat, like SEO, like how to promote yourself, right? How to brand yourself, how to advertise yourself in 2019, how to get leads, how to get customers. All of those things are things that we went through high level, deep dive, all of it for several days. So one of the things that you need to know when you're watching Insurance Agent Training today, live, is we talked about one thing, Everyone always talks about how everything I wear, just about, is branded. I'm telling you, if you're not doing this, if you're not branding yourself, right, number one, and if you're not always wearing and promoting your brand, then what are you doing? Now, I'm not talking about just always throwing it in people's faces, right? That, hey, I sell insurance, hey, I sell insurance, hey, I sell insurance, right? I'm not always throwing in people's faces, hey, I train agents, hey, I train agents, hey, I train agents, right? Or, hey, I market for agents. Or, hey, we build sites for agents, right? Or, or hey, you know, we generate leads for agents, right? Or, hey, I coach insurance agents. We're not always, or, hey, we throw a conference for agents. We're not always putting that out there and throwing it in people's face. So you guys see me do it through video. You see me do it through swag, right? Even on my Apple Watch, a CA logo, all of it, right? So you guys see me, but also through Instagram stories, Facebook stories, random videos, right? Personal page. I'm not always throwing in people's faces that, hey, you need to buy stuff from me. I am focused on educating and providing value. That's one of the things that we talked about. At this retreat this weekend, pay attention now, this is good. People do business with people that educate them. Who educates you better than anyone else in the insurance industry? And a lot of you do business with us because we focus on educating you and bringing value to you. Instead of, I'm going to shift to give you a little, little better lighting here. Instead of simply just always preaching, instead of always selling, instead of always pitching, Instead of telling you to always buy stuff from me. Instead, I'm telling you, the content approach, the marketing approach for 2019 and beyond is a value first approach. And if you're not doing that with the branding of yourself, with, with, the, with, with all your social media, with everything that you do, you need to be. It's a value first approach. It's an educate first approach. And it's a sell last, right? It's, it's all about nowadays... It's all about how much can I give away for free so that when someone thinks about that topic, they think about me. Most people are backwards. Like the old way, we talk about this a lot at the retreat, the old way is, hey, keep everything close to the chest. Don't tell anybody your secrets. Don't think about, it. Don't, don't, don't tell everybody too much, right? That's the old way. The new way is, hey, here's all that I'm gonna provide for free, like we do these shows constantly, videos constantly, everything we do, we see how much we can give away. And in turn, I give so much value, so much content, that a couple things happen. And you can do the same thing in your business. And we talk about this a lot at the retreat. And if you missed it, I'm telling you, I got another one in June, you gotta be there. See, that's a soft sell in the middle of providing value. And that's okay. The way you gotta approach this today is, how much can I give away, right? Am I putting emphasis on educating people along the way? Do I provide and bring enough value so that they care? And when they think of the services I offer, will they think of me? Now, they'll only think of you if you're educating them in the right way and providing more value than anyone else in your space. Like, I feel like, and that's why we had life insurance agents, Medicare agency owners, PNC agency owners, carriers, etc., pay to be on a retreat with us because we provide the most value from a content and training perspective as much as anybody in the industry. 
I give away so much stuff for free because I enjoy it and I understand that marketing in 2019, that that's part of it. And because of those things, guess what? The person that educates them is the person that they think of, that they think about training them, that they think about buying leads from, that they think about doing business with. So are you putting the right structures in place? This is insurance agent training. This is live training on the spot. Are you right now thinking about educating first, providing value, and giving away as much as you can for free? If you look at the course of the 1,200 videos that we've put out to the general public, to the insurance world, over the last three and a half years, no one else has done that. Find me someone that's provided more free content to insurance agents, agency owners, IMOs, carriers, call centers, etc. than we do. But when you that's why you but that's how you need to think. When you think about growing your business, when you think about when you think about putting your message out there to the world so that when they think about something you have to offer, they think of you, think about that approach. How how can you give away so much content, so much value and so consistently that when they think about life insurance? Medicare, joining an agency, right? Recruiting, building a call center, right? When they think about buying home and auto insurance, car insurance, when they think about, you know, purchasing an annuity, when they think about investing, when they think about, you know, an IUL, whatever, college funding, college planning, any, any of it. When they think about any of these things, who do they think about? Who do you think about? Who comes to mind first? When you think about, um, when you think about Medicare, and selling Medicare supplements, who comes to your mind first? Well, what are they doing so that they come to your mind first? And how can you also do those exact same things that they are, but better, more value, spend more money, pump it out more and do it more consistently so that when someone thinks about Medicare sub selling Medicare supplements, they don't think about them, they think about you. So uh, today I want, I, want you, I want this to be a thought-provoking episode of Insurance Agent Training that gets you thinking about how do you advertise, market, brand, and promote in 2019 so that later on in, the, later on in 2019, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2030, 2040, 2050, even 2060, they think of you, right? So that, that's the message for today. Hope you receive it well. Hope you have an incredible rest of, I hope you have a dominating week. Think about the things that you can do to be top of mind and help a lot of people. And the first way is to get around people that inspire you, that motivate you, that challenge you, that you can learn from. Pay to learn the things that you need to know. That's one big takeaway, big secret I, that I, I put out to the world all the time, is I paid to learn the things that I needed to know to scale my business. That's why this retreat, that's why the five people that paid to be on this retreat took away so much value, they were blown away. So think about how you can implement this into your business right now and forever so that you dominate your niche of this industry for many years to come. Thanks for watching Insurance Agent Training. Hope you have an incredible rest of your week, an awesome day. We'll see you tomorrow for Phone Phenom. Appreciate you guys.